Hey, how's it going, Rodies? Uh, my computer's being a fucking idiot. Hey, get out of network settings. Hey. Hey, I don't care about network settings. No. Get out of here. Fuck you. There it goes. Woo, okay, there you go. How is it going? On the last installment, let me check options. On the last installment, uh, we freaking beat so many, so many things. I wish I could play multiplayer, but I have no friends. Single player. <laughs> <coughs> Why do I keep coughing? I need to stop coughing. That's gross and annoying and spikes audio. On the last installment, we beat the second cup. Oh, wait. Let's go back. Uh, I'll beat Patrick later, but I just want to be... I, I, I want to be Plankton. Plankton's really good. Look at his top speed. It's so good. Let me up the game audio a little bit. Give me one second, roadies. There you go. Now at least you'll be able to hear the music a little bit better. Uh, wait, did we do cup two already? Shit, we did do cup two already. There you go. Good job, Nate. You know how to select menus. So, Rodies, how's your day been going? Uh, are you enjoying Nicktoons Racing? I'm really enjoying Nicktoons Racing. What's your favorite Nicktoon? My favorite Nicktoon is probably Spongebob. Just because uh, Spongebob's hilarious, and I can quote the shit out of that. Let's see if I'm as good as I was yesterday. There you go. Fuck out of here. So, uh, another funny story. Ha ha. I have to buy, like, a $15 splitter in order for my uh, Vita or PlayStation TV to work because the PlayStation TV with its stupid HDCP chip uh, will freak the fuck out if you plug anything into it. So, of course, I can't play Criminal Girls, so I'll have to tell my like creepy stories in this Let's Play, which I really didn't want to because I wanted this to be safe for the whole family. But whatever. Her! Yeah, I got him. Fuck out of here. I'm the one who knocks. Say my name. But seriously, folks, uh, I'm just going to lean back in my chair really quick. You probably heard my chair squeak. I have an old Lazy Boy. Lazy Boys are... Damn it! Lazy Boys are awesome. Get me out of the bubble. Technique! And that is a bubble bubble, not a spit bubble like I thought earlier. Lol, whoops. It makes more sense if it's a bubble bubble. Because technique! Technique, 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 technique! First I do this. Spin around, stop. Double take three times. Here we go. Pelvic thrust! You know, my, my brother and I, our favorite line from Spongebob is from uh, the the box when uh, uh, Patrick and Spongebob get the box from Squidward's TV and their plan, plan is out of it and the line is, uh, Patrick, we need to keep our voices down in case of avalanches. What? I said we need to keep our voices down in case of avalanches. What should we keep down? And then Squidward's like, morons. Oh! That's like the best line from it. But no. Uh, you know what's scary? When you enter the weird side of Tumblr. Get out of here, I guess. Oh, he jumped over the puddle. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm going to take your coconuts, dog. Ready? Coconut. Nice. Uh, but there's a, there's a really weird side of Tumblr. Like, you'd think that Tumblr would just be really good fan art. Like, there's some Tumblr artists that I like a lot that are just so freaking good. You know, like uh, Stealing Your Waifu is one of my favorite Tumblr artists. Um, I can't really think of any because I've just been enthralled by her artwork recently. There you go. There's the blue shell. There's two blue shell uh, powers in this. Dreshkins! Uh But Stealing Your Waifu is my favorite uh, Tumblr artist. She does, uh, actually, again, she doesn't do sexual art. She does like really cute art of uh, like Steven Universe and Wander Over Yonder. So I like it. It's really good. Uh, but... Like, for every one really good Tumblr artist, there's, like, 28 who just love drawing uh, wieners. <clears throat> and then when you go to them, then you're like, oh, dear. Like, uh, there's one, speaking of Steven Universe, uh, a little bit not safe for work uh, topic here. Uh, I follow a whole bunch of, like, Steven Universe fandom pages on Facebook and Twitter because, you know, I like the show. And sometimes the fandom makes really good points. And they're like, fan theory, this is this. And then you're like, ooh. Or, hey, look at this uh, Jasper fan art. She's angry and holding a Game Boy Advance. And you're like, ooh, okay, that's kind of weird, but cool. Uh, but then you, okay, I'll, I'll hit start. I'll go to the next race. But then you get really creepy ones. Like, there was this one, uh, she's like, uh, someone posted on, I forgot which Steven Universe fan page, but it was one of them. Yeah, she was like, hey, you should check out my, uh, Steven Universe uh, Tumblr page. I do a whole bunch of cool Jasper and Lapis fan art. And at first I was like, oh, cool. 
I'll I'll give it a look. And I didn't know it was uh, that side of Tumblr. So what happened? <laughs> uh, let me just go into creepy detail here. Cover your ears and mute it for the next like minute if you don't want to hear this. But uh, there was freaking. It's if you want to look it up, and don't be surprised. It's called Better Underwater at Tumblr.com. Why am I getting... Oh, everyone gets hit with a stump. I get it. So I guess the, the that's like a super blue shell. The jellyfish is the real blue shell. Damn it. Um, but Better Underwater.tumblr.com is a really creepy Tumblr. Because half of the... Half of it is Las, yeah, Lasper, which is uh, Lapis Cross Jasper fan fiction. And the other half is like... People, girls with penis envy talking about how much they'd love to have a wiener, which is really, like, I mean, good on you, but don't tell me about it. That's all I'm saying. But seriously, there was one fan, like, picture on that vlog that, that I was like, okay, enough internet. This happened, like, a week and a half ago. Uh, after after I clicked the link, because they were like, oh, it's an innocent vlog, blog about Steven Universe. And I was like, okay, cool. And I was a complete fool. But um, what happened... What the picture is, someone actually requested to this page, allegedly, to have them draw this. But, again, grossness. Grossness warning. Uh, and, again, if you're into this, don't care. Again, I don't kink shame. But it was Lapis across Jasper. Jasper had cat ears and a cat tail. Uh, Lapis had gills for some reason. Uh, one of them had vampire gloves, which if you don't know what vampire gloves are, they're like... I, I know my innocence was taken away a long time ago. They're like bondage gloves. Oh, the background's freaking out. They're like bondage gloves, except they have like spikes in them. So it's pretty creepy. Uh, and uh, they both have tentacle dicks. So let me just rewind the tape. Uh, you, okay, how many fetishes do you need to be into to like that one picture? Well, you have to be into BDSM, you have to be into spanking, you have to be into lesbians, you have to be into probably at least one of the characters from the show. You have to be into tentacle dicks. Which is still gross. Um, Freaking, oh, okay, I made that jump. And you have to be into a lot of other weird stuff. And uh, again, I don't, I don't kink shame. I don't blame anybody. But that did that was like, okay, I'm done. Because I'm part of the Steven Universe fandom, but the fandom is cancer. And I, I, I'm aware of it. So, at least I'm aware of it. So, if anyone's like, oh, you're part of those fans? You must, you must really blink, 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 blink. Then I'll be like, not really. Because, again, like, half the internet is... If you're in a fandom, either A, you really like the show, or B, you just want to have intercourse with everyone on the show, which I really like the show. But apparently, people in those blogs, it's the second thing. Okay, enough being creepy. I'll talk about cartoons. Or something. I don't know what to... Shit! I wasn't even in the water. You guys saw that. Shit, fifth place. No! That's the last lap. No! Okay, I'll get Ickis out of the way. Go around the corner. I really want to win. I'm the best around. I'm in third. There you go, Bubble. Yeah. Now we just got Darwin. Oh, Darwin's going to get jellied. But I hit a rock. Shit. No. Okay. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. That was 100% luck. That was awesome. Woohoo! And I think I beat that race completely. Yeah. And this I'm gonna you know fuck it. I'm gonna I'm gonna do two. I'm gonna do two. I'm gonna wrap this game up really quick. Let's try to be Patrick. No well we're hard we're on hard difficulty now. So I really want I'll be playing it. I don't care. And now that we're on a hard difficulty. Okay. Final wave. We have to do this on hard. And they don't lie, like the computers are assholes on this difficulty. You know? But I digress. Also, there's hardly any tracks in here. There's just nine, tra wait, there's, yeah, there's 12 tracks. And they filled an entire GBA cartridge with nine tracks, or 12 tracks. But I keep saying it's nine. Uh, which is terrible, because games at the same time ha ha were like Pokemon... And they put, son of a bitch, and they put, like, the entirety of Super Ghouls and Ghosts on a GBA cartridge. That's pretty sweet. That game's awesome. And it probably takes up more memory than this. Too fast. Jump. 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 
Jump! Go ahead and jump! I'm back here, Arnold. Damn it. Ah, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're good. Everything's good in the hood. I'm all right. Nothing to worry about me. There you go. How far ahead is... Damn it! Fuck you. No, I forgot you can't use weapons. Fuck you! Yeah. Okay, second's fine. How did Arnold get so far ahead? Okay. I'm going to try to win. I know I've beat this before when I was a child. I should be able to beat it. Also, Arnold has the weirdest stats because he's three out of six on everything. So he's like the perfect all-around car, you know? But I'd rather have uh, more speed, which is what I allegedly have, which I don't think so. Because Stimpy is catching up to me. And this is hard difficulty, so I'm not surprised. Oh, shit, fuck. I missed, oh, why do I always miss that corner? Patrick got hit with something. And I fucking hate that power. It only affects me, I swear, because it just blinds me and everyone else is like, I'm good. Have a bubble. Hopefully I win. This shit's going to get hard. I was able to flawlessly do uh, 100cc. And I missed. Whatever. God damn it. Arnold, come back. Come back, you fucker. I need a miracle. There you go. Bubble works. Later, fucker. And then we'll be tied, so I guess that's better than losing. And we're good. And across the line. Wow. Arnold and uh, Simpy were really close. Also, I called him Ren in one of my other videos. Lol. Whatever. I never watched Ren and Stimpy that much as a kid. You see how bullshit that is? If you're tied with somebody, they win. So, I have to beat him. Reptar Raceway, go. And off I go. Blankton powers activate. Hmm. Jumbalaya. Oh, I got a kiss with that can. Trashcans! I need to stop saying that. <gasps> I'm drunk. Whatever. I need to stop being drunk. Come on. Coconuts. Yeah, I got two of them. That was skill, actually. Remember, on, I don't know if it was part two or part three, but remember when I got shotgun blasted by the coconuts? That was hilarious, actually. I was really mad, but it was funny. Because it's funny. I need to not fall in that pit. Why is Arnold so far ahead? He's, like, unbelievably far ahead. What the shit? Come back here, you fucker. Damn it. I need to get something heat-seeking. Come on, hit him. Yeah. Fuck you. Later, bitch. Later, tater. Also, you know what's weird? My coworkers, like, half of them call me Nader Tater or Nado Potato now. I'm okay with that nickname, though. It's funny. 34 seconds dead. Come on, yeah, Arnold fell to the back of the pack. Oh, he's coming back up. He's coming back up. Boy, oh, no, no. Boy, oh, no. Boy, oh, no. I'm all the way up. All the way up. All the way up. Where are you, Fat Joe? I'm all the way up. I'm on top of Mount Everest. That song sucks. If you like it, whatever. If you don't like it, you're on my side. I love singing it at work, though, just to upset people, like my uh, co-worker and buddy of a long time, Ty. I always sing it uh, to him, just because it's funny. You know? And it's awful. Oh, man. I'm so itchy. Did I oh, Arnold got fifth? Nice! Something must have clubbed him. Now I'm definitely going to win. Let's see. Yeah! We got a big lead on that idiot. Let's go. But this is Arnold's track, so let's see how good he does. Come on. On plankton, I believe in plankton. Here's your chum plankton bleep blap. Oh man, 
And if you guys want me to do time trial mode as well, I probably will. Because I love this game, but time trial mode is essentially just the same 12 tracks again, but I'll probably be Patrick or something. Yeah. Just so I'm someone different other than Patrick. Patrick. No, this is Patrick. Damn it. I still got a speed boost, though. That was weird. Uh, I love watching this. The, damn it. I love watching the feed, like, on my computer screen, just because on the com my computer screen, it's, like, a 10-second delay just to, like, show you what you were recording, which is pretty cool. Uh, but, again, I keep getting distracted by it <laughs> instead of looking at the actual gameplay. Dude, fuck you, Stimpy. Get off your high horse, Stimpy. This game is kind of headache-inducing after you play it for a while. There's Arnold. I'm here, you little fucker. Toast. Damn it. That's fine. Second's good. Wow, he beat that track so fast. And I still win. Hooray! On the next installment, probably the last installment of Nicktoons Racing, I'm going to play Cup 2 and Cup 3 and hopefully get gold in both of them. See you in the next one, and thank you so much for watching. It means a lot, actually.